Welcome to another episode of Real Coasts. Standing now on uh, the rock platform at Browley Head. I'll just flip the camera around and show you. So you can see uh, the, the beach over there and the edge of the rock platform. And if I bring the camera around this way, you can see quite a lot of uh, complex topography on this platform. And then round to uh, this little uh, erosion area here and a little rock wall that's been built to uh, support the, the car park uh, behind. So one of the interesting things about this rock platform is that it's uh, composed of basalt. Uh, and that makes quite a contrast with some of the other rock platforms in this region. Uh, and you can hopefully see lots of uh, boulders around on this platform. And during storms uh, and storm surges, and especially uh, when those storm surges coincide with high tide, we can have water uh, and waves moving across this platform and uh, transporting some of these boulders uh, across the platform surface. As you move uh, and look out towards the the uh, ocean there, the edge of the platform, the seaward edge, appears to be higher or slightly higher than where we're standing right now. And that's a feature called a rampart, uh, something that we uh, can discuss in, in our lectures. And uh, interestingly, there is a small kind of beach almost at the back of this, of this platform, uh, partly composed of sand and boulders. And that beach would be active at times uh, of storms uh, when, when you have waves propagating across this platform. And indeed, this uh, erosion uh, scarp here, which is uh, eroding into the, um, the um, sort of clay material uh, that's come down from this, this cliff behind, uh, is also active during, uh, during storms. Uh, so storm waves are hitting that, that cliff and, and causing uh, the erosion.